Hi, this is Joe Davis with GotBaseballCards.com. I'm a lifelong sports card collector and hobby veteran for over 30 years. We are very excited to offer you this channel to provide you the finest in sports card news and entertainment. Thanks for watching. Hey guys, it's Joe and Doug. And we're back in the studio today reliving some childhood memories. Doug, what's the first year you bought cards? I, I actually got my first Topps cards in 1975 and it was a great year to get was. cards i was enamored with the multicolors. it was it was so crazy it was beautiful to me and they still are to this day my favorite set 1975 tops and 1975 minis which i was never in the right region to ever get those you didn't but fly up to michigan as a kid huh? that's yeah. correct but 75 was when i started but yeah. i can tell you that i collected every year since then yeah well i uh i started my first packs with 76 and then uh really got serious in 77 and 78 and speaking of 78 we're gonna have a little fun today doug and i are gonna relive some childhood memories for all of you here on camera we're gonna each pop a pack of 78 baseball i've had these sitting in my office and I'm like, Doug, you want to open some 78 tops for our viewers? And he's like, yeah, sure. So as long as I can keep whatever's inside. We shall see. Now, if you get a Jim Mint Eddie Murray, we got to talk. Oh. You got to at least give me a first shot to buy it. So, <laughs> All so, right. so if you very love excited. 70s baseball. Very excited. And you're like, I can't afford packs of this stuff anymore. We're doing it for you, our YouTube subscribers. So re get ready. Sit back on the couch. Kick back. Let's have some fun. Can't wait. Oh, right now. <laughs> so, 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 let, wait, we got to preface it. So, who are we hoping to pull? Um, let me think. I would, I wouldn't mind having a, a Dale Murphy. I know it's not his first year. Yeah. And he's on four, four on the Lance card. Lance Parrish rookie. But I love the, I love the yeah. little tiny heads. And Key member of the championship of course, Eddie, Tigers. Eddie Murray. Yep. Yeah. Um, what about you, Joe? Anything you're um, anxious for? I love the Nolan Ryan card from that year. I love the uh, the George Brett. It's an early card on Brett. Uh, it's an early card on Yount, of course. Uh, yeah, second year Murphy, second year Dawson. I love the Brooks Robinson, last Brooks Robinson card. I didn't know that. So, yeah, great, great. And we've got, I think there was 726 or had yeah, it was a 726, 726 set, and each pack comes with. A stick of bubble. It doesn't say how many cards. I believe these were... But usually 14 or 15. I think these may have only been 12. I'm, I'm guessing 12. But they they really look fresh, brand yep. new. Yep. Just like when I used to go to the Treasury Drugstore and buy my packs. They would have them in the candy section in 1978. And I'd always dig down and get the ones off the bottom. It didn't matter. The collation back then was not as super good, so I was always short trying to complete yeah. my set. That's what created a set builder in me was the fact that I could never complete these sets until 1987 when Joe helped me finish all of my old sets um, because card shops were a little more prevalent then. Yeah. So we've got uh, two packs shooting for the Eddie Mur hey, you know, Now, I wouldn't mind the Molitor Trammel rookie especially a clean one because for those of you you know we talk about psa green all the time that is one of the toughest cards from the 70s to ever find a high grade on because centering absolutely and they typically come with a black print mark so we're looking for a clean i mean maybe maybe you'll get the murray and i'll get the monitor well, and we'll be we're kind know. of i mean those are out of two packs that's a big dream. You got though. a dream. You got a dream. <laughs> I, I said so, dream. If, if I'm opening packs, it's expensive. I got a dream. So. All right. All right. What am I going to do? Far away. Oh, I'm so nervous. All right. Let's see here. You want Everybody to, cheer him on. You want to Remotely zoom, cheer him on. You want to zoom go. in down there? I don't think that's a good one. Do you have any other possible? Ah, there we go. I like that one. Oh, that's floating. All right, mm. here we go. Oh, I can remember these wax packs. Oh, 
Looks like Catfish Hunter is peeking through. No, no, he's no. Wayne Gross, maybe. Ooh, ooh. It is Wayne wow, Gross. Wow, you remembered it. We need to have fun with it. Let's see how where'd, many we can name. Where'd the gum go? Let me see how many I can name without seeing the Joe. Oh man, they shorted us on the gum. Wait, what is let me up get down with here. that? No what is it? Up oh, that. wait a minute. Oh, I was going to say, how did that happen? It's there we go. There's a sweep. That's sweet the, piece of that's 42 a, year old gum. That's a mm. sweet rolling now, office. Now, can, can it pop off without. Wow. Still, still ready to be chewed. All right, I got to play the game. Can I guess the name? Can you just show me the tops of the Oh, cards? I like that. That's a good Let's idea. See if, see if we can. All right. Let's see how we yeah, are in our spot. Saw. So let's. I see the wax on the front though. That's so yeah, awesome. Yeah. I know. I'll take I know. it slow. Oh. Uh, oh. Oh. The oh, short stop. Oh man, what was his name? Stearns. I can't remember now. How about uh, Tom? I don't, Tom. I don't remember. Lewis. No, no, he's a pitcher. Skip. Skip Lockwood. I well, skipped out on that one. Skipped out on that one. Oh, uh, third base, maybe for the Houston maybe Astros. Maybe Enos Cabell, maybe. Wow! <laughs> Cold shot. Joe remembered Enos Cabell from seeing the top of his hat on seventy-eight tops card. Uh, Somebody's ooh, peeking out wow. from there. First baseman for the Angels. It's not Remy. I don't remember this one. Montanez. Tony Salida. Tony Salida. Wasn't he on The Sopranos? I think that was a different that was a different Tony. Oh, I gave uh, you an eyebrow. Uh, Billy Buckner. That's, Billy Buckner coming up. That's too easy. Yep. All right, where's oh, our don't drop that one. <laughs> no. <laughs> get down. Yeah, yeah, I gotta get down for Did me. they not teach you that? Yeah. The first day of Little League. So far I don't see uh, any any was four. that? Oh, uh, Damasco Garcia. Uh, no. Dave Lemanchik. Dave Lemanchik, Blue Jays. I didn't know my Blue Jays well because I couldn't uh, watch Canadian baseball. I'd say Jack Morris, but he's on a four card. Right. <laughs> Woody Fryman. Mm -hmm. Let's see, see a little eyebrows. It's a Detroit pitcher. Uh. I did like Aurelio. I don't know. John Hiller. Aurelio. Yeah, yeah. Well, he has two L's in his name. Yeah, yeah. That, that was throwing you off. Well, I can say partway through the pack, so far, we have not hit a Murray or a... Denny? Uh, is that uh, Denny? Lam no, no. Hold Ma, on. Ma. Or is it Rich Dower? No, Scott McGregor. <laughs> oh, wow. Lord. Wow, we are straight. Our memory is fading. It's been 42 years since we opened these as a kid. Our memory is fading. I know that next one. It is a checklist. <laughs> Joe. Got that one right. It's a high series checklist. Do you, do you? They didn't have high series. So it's, it's the last series. How about the last series it's checklist? It's the high number checklist. Oh, still. Oh. Socks. Lamar? I can't remember if he was just. No. no Don Kirkwood. Kirkwood. I, I like his. I like that hat. Uh, wait, hold on, hold on. I remember this guy. First base for the Orioles. Oh. Uh, is it Pat, Ke not Pat Kelly, no. Critch? Uh, Bobby, no. Tony Muser. Man. Man, this pack is Weird. dynamite. Yeah. Well, uh oh. You got some Jim Minton possibilities because they're gorgeous. They're centered. They're gorgeous corners. We just haven't hit the big names yet. Uh, we've got an A's pitcher, not Vita Blue. Um, no, Joe Coleman. Relative of yours? Oh, no, no that's first yeah, name. Yeah, sorry. Right. Right. Oh. Uh, let's say. Shortstop. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, man, who's good? Uh, what is his name? He was a giant shortstop for, let's give the first letter. John. Johnny, Johnny LeMaster. All right. Halfway there. Yeah. <laughs> got the last name. And Your we got the last card which, that which had gum the, yeah. all over the back of uh, it. 
one of my favorite braids. Yeah, I remember. I loved it when they said we were they were hanging out in Roland's office in the outfield. Very nice. Yeah. All right, so we got a bunch of gorgeous '78 tops that are all mostly gradable except for Roland in that top card, but no star. I mean, Billy Buckner's maybe our only. I think he was a former All Star, wasn't he? No. Oh. Yes, very crisp, very nice. Wow. Are these packs for sale on the website, Joe? Um, I don't believe they are. We need to get some on there. Don't I don't know. Either. Showing showing this pack the way we have. The rest ones have got to get better. All right. All right. I loved you order your team checklist. Did you ever do that? I did not. Me neither. I did, you know, back when they had the football game that was on the electric field. Oh, yeah, yeah. I did order different teams for my game. All right. That's pretty nerdy. I think I know the first one. <laughs> what? See if you know. Lou? No. I believe that is... Dick? I believe it's Ed Figueroa. Oh, yeah. Is that Ed Figueroa peeking out? Yep. All right. I had a few of them. Another another classic another gum pack. Clean pack. Crisp piece of gum. Boom. All right, here we go. We got Ed coming up. We've got I believe that could be is that Denny Doyle? That'd be uh, a right. crazy Doyle. guess if you know that. Nope, Bernie Carbo. Bernie Carbo. That a little bit. All right. Third card coming up. We've got a catcher. Gene. Gene. Gene that mean Gene Okerlund. Not uh, Okerlund. Oh, yeah. Sorry. That was WWE. <laughs> mean <laughs> Gene Tennis. He spells his name funny for tennis. Tennis. Oh, I yeah. cheated on that uh -oh. one. I didn't mean to go up. I forgot. We got a break. Uh oh. From we the outfield. Rolling office. I think it's Pat Corral. And all I've seen is the hat. Let's see. Go a little more. Oh no, no, no. Uh, Rod, I think it's Rod Gilbreth. Rod Gilbreth. Really? Tom Pachori. Like I said, Rod Gilbreth. All right. All those those Braves were just uh, so great back then. Uh, they get a little mixed up. Oh, that one's that one's being tough. That must be a yeah. That's a special that one. Must be. It's sticking. Oh, Mariner. Oh, I know that. Yeah, Willie, so. maybe? I think it's. Oh, it's a rookie. Rupert? Rupert. That's who I'm thinking. Rupert Jones? Rupert Jones would be the Rupert. Ah! I got, got it. He wanted to take it up. Got, got another one. Got a Dodger pitcher. Huff! You huffing? I'm huffing <laughs> at that one. That's that my guess. Is, uh, Charles W. Bert Hooten. Hooten. Yes. <laughs> they call him Bert. Yeah, 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 yeah. Bert Newton, <laughs> one of the stars of the Dodger rotation back then. I know this one well. Is that either Yastrzemski or Lynn? That would be Freddie Lynn. That would be a third Mr. Lynn, third year Lynn. That's pretty nice. Uh, a little off center. Fifth, fourth, fourth. What was that? That was a rookie. Ah, my year, and I should have known that. Um. Uh, Steve Yeager. Nope. I believe this. Davey is. Lopes. Yes. What? Oh, it's the second baseman? Second baseman for the Dodgers would be Davey Lopes. Now we're starting to crack it up here. Yeah. We've got Fred it's, Lynn, Dave Lopes, two of the biggest. Fred Lynn's in teams. the Hall of Fame, right? Uh, he did visit the other week. No, I'm pretty sure. I, I don't know. I can, I'm surprised I that some players is. are not. He was, little known fact, Fred Lynn. Rookie year, rookie of the year, and MVP. MVP rookie season. How often do you see that? I don't. Not I since don't I played. <laughs> All right, we've got a Cardinals outfielder. Uh, Ken Forsh. He was a pitcher. I His brother know. Steve Forsh. How about Mike Anderson? Mike. Oh. Wow. wow I'm we, tearing things up. I here. hope there's not a. Knocking um, over our. I hope there's not a there, there was Eddie a, Murray. There was a Jim and Eddie Murray before I knocked <laughs> it over. No, right. Nobody's going to want us to open packs for him, Joe. Yeah. 78 Texas Ranger outfielder. And the guess is 
Bavakwa. Don't grieve over this. I am very upset. Tom grieved. That I did not get that one. Oh, let's give our viewers a... I don't know a shortstop for the... I know him, I though. I know the name, but uh, I can't Bobby remember. Gritch, I want to say his name so many times. Chris ah. Spear. They all had these, mustaches back yeah, then, didn't these, they? These are gorgeous cars. They are so short. Just need the big name to come out. Got a giant outfielder. Number 20. With, with one eye open. He's squinting at us. Vic. Good old Vic. I think he's card number like 540 something. I'll look at that in just a minute. Vic Harris. And now we're moving on to. Another expo. This expo. is uh, whoever had Montreal in the break was awesome. That is. Uh, I guarantee I know this Childs? one. Childs? Nope. I guarantee it. Why? Did you look at it? I did. <laughs> Lance, Lance Parrish. Ah, I said him earlier. I should get credit for that. Coming up on a Reds outfielder. Uh, Austri that, Austri that would be Champ Summers. I believe. Uh, you're cheating again. Nope. nope. Oh, wow. Look at the, the gum bleed uh, through that car. Champ Summers. I wonder if it bled through the next one. Nope. Nope. Champ Summers. Next time, don't say Eddie Murf Murray or Murphy. Eddie Murphy. Yeah. I, I was yeah. surprised we I, didn't uh, get an Eddie Murphy in there. Yeah. But. yeah. Or no, Orsenio Hall. Either one. Well, but, you know, when they were coming to not, America. He's, in, was, he's a 79, uh, Arsenio. He uh, was a little, uh, little uh, younger. Well, all Eddie. we have left is the gum. Oh my goodness, that doesn't look very appealing to me. I dare you to eat it, Joe. I <laughs> Doug thinks he's going to tear me to eat a piece of 42-year-old gum. I don't think so. I double dare you. <laughs> no, sir, Bob. If you double dare me. Oh, now I got to take him up on it. Here we go. Bottoms up. Just like it was back then. Actually, it tastes fresher, I, yeah, I think, think than so. it did in 1978. Well. I don't think I can stay any longer, you know, Joe. Can you please sign off? Sign off, Joe and Doug. All right.